All right, hey, what we're doing here today is what I call the cue and ride. So uh, to describe this, we're gonna give a little example. Um, who, who likes it when their mother nags at them while they're doing their chores? So imagine you're doing a chore, uh, you know, whatever the chore is, right? Making your bed or doing the dishes or whatever, right? And your mother comes up to you while you're doing the dishes and the mother says, do the dishes, do the dishes, do the dishes. And so, uh, who likes that? Nobody likes that, right? While you're doing the dishes. This is called nagging. So a lot of people do this with horses where they nag the horse when they're trying to turn the horse. So let me demonstrate what the nag looks like. It looks like this. <laughs> Holding onto the rein like this. I don't wanna hold onto the rein. I wanna do what's called cue and ride. So let me demonstrate what our cue and ride is. The cue and ride is, is I want you to lift the rein, release, and then follow with your right boot and go through. So let me do it again. So let me do it several times here. So you're going along, we wanna turn this way. Cue, release, ride. Ride with that right foot. Now we're gonna do it again. Cue, release, ride with that right foot. Cue, release, ride with that right foot. Cue, release, ride with that right foot. Now we'll do it left side. Cue, release, ride with that left foot. Cue, release, ride with that left foot and ride with your body up there. You can work right here. Cue, release, ride with that right foot. The key is to not be holding on to the rein. Drop the rein and then ride it, right? Cue it, release, and ride it. Do it in motion. Cue, release, ride. Cue, release, ride. Ride it. Ride it. Ride it. Cue, release, ride. Cue, release, ride. I don't want to see any of this. I want to see one cue, one release, and a follow through with the, the foot and the body to ride. Okay, that's our theme for the week.